Toothbrush abrasion is the damage to teeth and gums that often occurs when you brush your teeth improperly. Improper brushing can be destructive because teeth and gums are more fragile than they seem. This can cause problems like receding gums, wearing away of the tooth root, sensitive teeth, and weaker teeth. Sometimes it's hard to tell if you're brushing destructively, and brushing habits can be hard to break. To avoid destructive toothbrushing, keep these factors in mind. A soft toothbrush, a non-abrasive toothpaste with fluoride, and a gentle technique. First, choose a soft toothbrush. A soft toothbrush is gentler on gums, and it's more effective at removing plaque from below the gum line, where periodontal disease starts. You can make the bristles even softer by running hot water over them before use. Next, use a pea-sized amount of non-abrasive toothpaste with fluoride. Toothpastes that are labeled whitening or tartar control can sometimes be too rough on receding gums and exposed roots, wearing away the root's protective layer. You can be sure a toothpaste is non-abrasive if it's labeled sensitive. Last, use proper brushing technique. Angle the bristles of the brush along the gum line at a 45 degree angle and apply just enough pressure so the bristles slide under the gum line. Vibrate the brush while you move it in short jiggling strokes and in small circular motions. Don't brush too hard. If you're not sure whether you're pressing too hard, hold the end of the brush with two fingers. That will give you enough force to get the job done without doing damage. Here's another tip. Check your brush bristles. If they're spread out, you're probably pressing too hard. If you find that you have a hard time brushing gently, consider using a power toothbrush. They make it much easier to use the right amount of pressure. You should also know that soda pop, sports drinks, and other acidic beverages can make teeth more vulnerable to toothbrush abrasion. So after having one of these drinks, rinse your mouth with water and then wait about 20 minutes before brushing. If you have any concerns about your brushing, talk to us. We can show you what you need to know to keep your mouth healthy and bacteria-free.